Earlier in the week, Karis Levert comes here and uh, trade deadline. Cavs talking, 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 but uh, Stan Pat, <laughs> when you look at this roster, it's pretty good and it's really young. It's deep too, Dave. Uh, you kind of were waiting to see what they might add that could maybe complement everything. And I, I think Karis Levert's the perfect guy to do that because he's a wing guy who can also handle the ball a little bit. And so you're looking for a little depth handling the basketball and another guy who can play the two guard, play the small forward spot at the, at the three position. And I, I think he's a perfect fit there. Happy to be here, Ohio guy, getting back home. And so he's pretty happy about it. And I think he's gonna be a real nice addition. And, and again, everybody's all excited because uh, what a game and a half out of first place in the Eastern Conference. This team's a couple of years from being a serious championship uh, contender. Let them grow. Let them go. Let them develop. Are, are they really? I think so. Do you, do you think? What do you think? Uh, I would think you're right, except I don't know that anybody thought that they would be where they are right now. So when you're this close to first place in an Eastern Conference that's really up in the air, I, I don't know, though, though in theory, I think everybody should probably agree with what you said because, you know, their starters are all 24 and younger. You would think that needs to mature, but never thought they'd be where they are right now. So I wouldn't rule anything out this year, uh, yeah, especially in the East. I would agree. Now, the, the East got a little bit more difficult with the Sixers and the, and the uh, Nets trade with Harden uh, going to the Sixers and, and Simmons going to the Nets. But... Um, you're right. We'll see what happens. That's the best way to, to discuss it.